Brand new project, this one's for an investor, 130K. We're gonna add massive value and revalue at 170. Can't wait to show you, let's take a look. So I'm just at my latest project. It's a wicked two up, two down in the heart of Derby. Moments away from the university and a really affluent family area, but it's also just up the road from town. I watched it on right move for months and months. I watched it come on the market, off the market, sales were falling through and the price went lower and lower and lower until my estate agent mate texted me and said, listen mate, you need to move on this one. So I picked it up for 130,000 pounds, 10 doors down, sold for 152 recently, across the road sold for 158 or 159. So we're gonna add value to it, refinance it, at a higher amount and today I just want to give you a tour and we'll come back here in a few months so you can see it when it's done. But yeah, looking around now, walls look really, really good. Uh, not much to do in here at all. Follow me. I think there's no cellar, it's just a fuse board and stuff. This is a really nice open planned area, lots of light, which I loved about it. And this kitchen isn't very old, so we might be able to avoid replacing it altogether. So as you can see, you know, not too bad at all. Could change doors, maybe could change the work surface just to give it a fresh, fresher feel. And, and what I've been doing in a lot of my properties lately is I've been getting rid of tiles and using the splashback. So you've got, a, basically you've got a lip. So one of the first things we've got to do is we're gonna have to rip out the property and we wanna see what's underneath these panels because they can sometimes be a sign that something nasty is behind them. So we'll rip it out and see if there's any issues. If there is damp, then we'll get that dealt with first things first before we go any further. So it's very, very hard to fully quote jobs up until you can see what's underneath things like that. So what we'll do is we'll strip this back until we can get a definitive quote over to the investor. In the meantime, we're working on ballpark figures, but we're normally there or thereabouts. So now we're upstairs, as I said, big bedroom at the front of the house. Mm, potential damp on the ceiling, so we'll need to get up on the roof and check that out, early doors. Carpets, not great, as you can see, so they'll be removed. It's a weird looking light up there. Hey, I love this room. This is really, really weird. Look at this. I don't know what to tell you, mate. I don't know what this would have been, but could be quite cool. Built-in storage, maybe, just to maximise the space. Rad, I think, needs to move from there, potentially to there, so we can have a wardrobe or we can have a desk. Um, Neighbours need to look after their garden a little bit better. And last but not least, shower room, which will need ripping out. We can't avoid it. Um, and I think that vanity might be better over here, so we can spread it. Toilet, vanity, um, sink, should I say. And we'll get rid of this for a nice chrome towel rad. So yeah, catch me back in a few months. This will probably be done in four weeks. And um, we'll show you the afters.